James Reimer gets hurt, Peter Morazic then gets hurt. What's going through your mind? Uh, I didn't know that both of them had been hurt. I was just kind of sitting there, and uh, once it was real and I was walking through the tunnel, I was uh, a little shaky. But uh, hey, what a great night. So. Sarah, based on your tweets, I imagine there was a lot going through you. What are you thinking on the second goalie injury? Um, so I saw it last minute, and I just saw him laying there, and it was my heart dropped. And that, and I'm excited to see him go in, but at the same time, I know how Toronto fans are, and they get a little, they get a little intense in that. So I didn't know how it was going to go. I knew he'd hold the fort, and he did a really good job. He said uh, when he was asked about you post game, uh, is she alive? Like, <laughs> what's the nerves like when you're watching him play in the NHL? It's horrible. It's absolutely horrible. Like, I don't know how these hockey wives do it in that. It's it's something else. I think I'm still shaking. Dave, what are you thinking? You looked. You bit, looked a bit nervous when you first came in there. Absolutely, I was nervous. Uh, we talked about it before, and I said, uh, she goes, if you ever get in, are you going to be nervous? I'm ah, no, I'll be, I'm fine. I'll be good. Don't worry about it. And then I step, as soon as I step on the ice and all the fans were here, and actually the fans were pretty good, they kind of went crazy when I stepped on the ice. I'm not sure if it was because I was wearing Leaf gear or they thought the Leafs were going to have an easy go, which I thought they probably would have had an easy go. But, hey, once I got out there and got calm, it was a lot of fun. It looked like you'd maybe turn the wrong way at first. Were you going to the wrong net? <laughs> I didn't even know where I was going. I just looked out there and I went this way and then I was like, oh, Freddie's there, so I'm going to go the other way. So, yeah, I, I found my way. You sure did. Sarah, when the first couple goals went in on Davey, uh, what are you thinking? I'm a Leafs fan, so oh, wow. <laughs> I knew he, I knew, I know he's a little shaky off the start, especially in something like this, but I had total faith in him coming back. He's overcome a lot. Oh, to get here what what, do you, what does this mean what do, what's it mean to you watching him i can't even explain it he's he's gone through his kidney transplant he's gone through so much diversity and i'm just i'm as proud as they come davy what, what dave what are you going to remember about tonight well, i think all of it once yeah. it kind of sinks in i get to watch a little bit more of it but i think my favorite part was the guys were so pumped at the end of the game and they came and basically jumped on me i was trying to stay on my feet i'm like just don't bust a knee here i want to you know stay alive after getting jumped on with all these guys but then going back in the dressing room and i got a water bottle shower and they were just so happy and such a great a great group of guys you know you never forget that and leaving the ice on this after the second period you know willie and then austin they kind of gave me a little wink and a tap on the pads so you know, it's great to get an acknowledgement from them, you know, being with them all year. And they're all great guys, too. So I'm sure they're fairly happy for me, but not necessarily happy for the outcome. you got some tremendous keepsakes here as well. Let's yeah. take a look at the stick from James Reimer. And you actually have a history with James. Yeah, James uh, was with the Marlies when I very first started. And I was on the ice with them uh, once or twice. And he, I, he remembered me. So, um, you know, he just kind of signed a stick and gave it to me. And that was unreal. Good guy. Hold the fort, the inscription. Thanks for yeah. holding the fort. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Thanks for holding the fort. And Rod Brindamore? He gave me a bottle of wine and said, thanks, for the, me thanks for the memories. Um, it. Says uh, to Dave, thanks for the memories. And he signed it. So he, he was happy. Uh, all the guys were happy. Obviously, I'm happy. So uh, what a night. Not going to forget this one. Sarah, what will you remember most about tonight? His smile. Honestly, his smile when I just saw him uh, coming out of the dressing room. Guys, thanks so much. Enjoy, oh, enjoy the moment. Uh, thanks so much for your time. Absolutely. Thank you very thank much. Thank you very much.